In this video, I want to show you how to set up Google Merchant Center here in Nigeria. Google Merchant Center helps you to advertise on Google Shopping. If you have an e-commerce website and you want to advertise on Google, the best advert for you is Google Shopping and this is going to be possible with the help of Google Merchant Center. Previously, Google Merchant Center is not allowed in Nigeria. In fact, you can only use Google Shopping for some countries like US, UK, Canada, Australia, Germany, South Africa and so on. But recently, Google announced Google Shopping for Nigeria. However, it's currently in the beta state. So in this video, I will show you how to set up your Google Merchant Center so that you'll be able to advertise on Google Shopping. Let me quickly show you what Google Shopping looks like. On this browser, I search for Xiaomi Redmi Note 8 Pro. By the way, this is not a Nigerian IP. I'm currently using a US IP because I want to show you exactly how Google Shopping looks like. Currently in Nigeria is still in beta state so you might not be able to see the shopping result if you search on Google. So right after entering my keywords, I go straight to the shopping option there and this is what comes up. All of these adverts are shopping ads. And as you can see, before you even go ahead and click on any of the adverts, you already know what you are expecting and if you click on it, that means you are going to the website to make your purchase for the product. So you see, Google Shopping is a very very good ad format if you are running an e-commerce website. So if I go ahead and click on any of these, it will show me the details of the product which is very amazing. And when I go ahead and click on this, it will take me to the website where I can complete the transaction. So this is the option that is not available in Nigeria for a very long time but is currently being launched in Nigeria and is still in the beta state. Now that it's in the beta state in Nigeria, I want to show you how to go ahead and configure your Google Merchant Center so that you'll be able to set up Google Shopping Ads on your Google Ads account. So now I will go straight to my page. And if you type google.com slash retail, you'll be able to see the option to proceed to Google Merchant Center. So I'll go ahead and click on sign in. If I click on sign in, you'll see the option there. The one I want to click on is the Google Merchant Center. So it takes me straight to the Google Merchant Center where I can complete my registration. So here on this page, I can proceed with the registration for my Google Merchant Center. So the first thing I want to choose here is the country. Previously, you might not be able to see your country here because it is only supported by some selected countries. So now, if I click on this country, I'll be able to check if Nigeria is among the country on the list. And here, Nigeria is on the list. So I selected Nigeria as my country. So the business name to display, I want to use or just web digital. Now, that is the business name I want to display. If you come back to this place to look at this particular advert, you will see each of the advert has the business name just below the pricing. You can see here is Walmart, this is eBay, this is Walmart. And another interesting thing about Google Shopping Ads is that your advert can appear multiple times in the single search. This is a very good opportunity if you want to advertise and you want all of your advert to be showing at the same time. This is going to be very possible with the help of Google Shopping. So let's go back and continue with the registration. Now I have entered my business name. The next thing I want to do is I want to select my timing. Already my timing has been selected by default. So I will click on continue. Now that I clicked on continue, it takes me to the next step where I will go ahead and configure this particular setting. May Google contact you about Merchant Center? Definitely, I want them to contact me about Merchant Center in case there is opportunity for me that I can use to improve my ads performance. So I'll go ahead and click on the I agree to the Merchant Center terms and conditions. I encourage you if you have the time, go ahead and read this. But I have been working with Google for a very long time and sometimes I have read some of these terms and conditions so I don't need to go ahead and read it again. But for you that is coming to use this platform, for the first time I encourage you to go ahead and read it so I click on continue and it will take me to the next page now I'm on the next page so what I want to do here is I want to choose the program that fits my objective you can see here do you want to sell across all Google surfaces or on shopping ads I want to sell both on shopping ads and all Google surfaces so I selected both and I click on continue but before I click on continue let me show you you can click on this little drop-down arrow and see the details of each of the options 
option so you can read it and you can see the second one and read it you see the countries where this one is available in you see nigeria is available in this particular list that is it and if you check the first one you might not see nigeria there i think the first one is very limited usa and india so i might not select the first one but because in the future update there might be support for nigeria so i will leave it selected and i will click on continue now i click on continue you can see the store name is there and the business country is nigeria you have see the option i've selected and you see the next thing here i will go ahead and click on create my account now i click on create my account and i will allow the page to load so that the dashboard can open for me to proceed with my configuration now i have successfully created my google merchant center account and there is a lot of other information that is needed for me to input into this merchant center account i will show you that in another video where i will be entering my information and i will also be verifying my merchant center account so that google can recognize this as a very legitimate business that has a physical location for you to be able to run advert on google shopping this is the first part of this video i will show you the second part where i'll be entering the information i will verify my website and i will claim the merchant center account thanks for watching this video and watch out for the next video if you like this video feel free to subscribe to this channel and share the video with your friends and family thanks again and bye for now